Hey guys, I'm back from my vacation, and I have to say I had a really good time. Um, hopefully, I can go again soon, um, but I will be trying a different cruise line because I'm not very happy with the way Carnival has changed in a year's time. I mean, I went last year, and it was completely, completely different than what it is now. Uh, maybe it was the ship that I was on. I don't know, but... Um, I didn't try my best to enjoy myself. Um, I will probably make a video about cruising and what I didn't like about this particular trip, but that'll be at another time. Um, so for right now, I will show you guys some footage from my vacation. It's mostly me vlogging, talking about like um, the food and, and if I've had any bad reactions to any of the food um, and a few pictures. Um, what I did get to go do is go to Cabo San Lucas and Puerto Vallarta. Uh, I did one excursion where they took us to a private beach and we did snorkeling. We swam with sea lions and um, unlimited drinks and all that. But, I mean, I had a really good time. I had a really good time and I just wanted to share some of the footage with you guys. Just it's Like I said, it's just me vlogging. They wouldn't allow us to film... Um, with the sea lions, which is another thing that I'm annoyed about, but that's another video. And I do have a couple pictures at the end, so I will see you guys next week. So this is day three, going on day four. We went to Cabo today, and it was pretty cool. Um, we have, you can't really see that much because it's dark, but you can see my reflection. And it's darkness out there, but we have a balcony suite. And look at the anniversary stuff. Ooh. They decorated our room for our three-year anniversary, so that was nice. Um, so far, I feel less claustrophobic in this suite. The bathroom's not that spacious, but... I mean, its purpose is just to brush your teeth and all that and get whatever you need to do done. So it serves its purpose. I'm pretty excited about this trip. I mean, it's gone pretty well for the past three days. I haven't gotten any, like, dumping syndrome or anything like that. I think I overate once, but I wasn't, I didn't throw up or anything. I did feel a little sluggish and yucky. But other than that, I didn't feel anything really terrible. As far as food goes, mm, I mean, there's a lot of choices. But when you sit down and you see something super delicious that you want to eat and you know you shouldn't eat it, it's kind of hard to say no, especially when you're, like, on vacation mode. I'll take a bite here and there, but that's pretty much it. I did have some chocolate-covered strawberries, and those went down pretty well. Um, I had maybe two, like, spoonfuls, not really spoonfuls, but I picked out Ron's ice cream and his chocolate cake, and that was okay. I've had a couple of drinks of alcohol, and that was okay as well. So, I mean, I haven't had any major issues. So, I did get a comment today and yesterday about not finishing my food. They asked if I liked it or not, or if something was wrong, if they could do anything to fix it, and, I mean, I just can't eat that much. Um, I did order some fries just to order them and I only ate one or two and obviously it looked like I didn't eat anything so the waiter was like, I got you the fries, you know, and I'm like, okay, sure. Um, but other than that, I haven't had any huge, huge issues. I think I'm pretty comfortable on this trip so far. Oh, well, well, there was one issue at the steakhouse where they got my order wrong and by the time they brought me... The new order, or they wanted to bring me the new order, I ha I was already kind of full, so there was no point in sending it back and getting a new one. I wasn't going to eat it anyway, so. They did give me a discount on it, which was fine, but I was a little upset because I really wanted to try some of the steak, and I couldn't because they cooked it wrong, so. Hmm. But that's probably the only setback that, I, that I've had. Um... But I will probably vlog more when we're headed back. Tomorrow we're stopping at um, Puerto Vallarta. And I might film something there. 
we are going to go to a private beach on an excursion and snorkeling and stuff. So I'll probably have some footage for that. But so far, I have to say that gastric bypass and this um, trip has not really been bad at all. It's been pretty good. So I will vlog more tomorrow. So we came to, where is it? What's it called? No, Las Caletas. It's a private, um, like, island, I guess you can say. We were over there, like, snorkeling a little while ago. So I wore shorts and a bathing suit. Um, what is it, a tankini, I guess you can say? And I felt okay, I guess. I didn't feel that self-conscious, but a little bit self-conscious. Try not to think about it. But it was a really good day. The food was really good. I didn't overstuff myself. If you can tell, I'm like super tired. Uh, we're just waiting for the ship to go, well, the boat to take us back to the cruise ship in like another 40 minutes. I just want to rest. Today's the last day of our trip. I kind of feel sad going back home, but I've had a really good time. Everything has been great. I mean, I have to say that I'm not... This is my second time traveling with Carnival, and I'm not that happy with everything that went on. I mean, for the most part, it was good, but there were some things that I was not happy with. The food has been great, sort of. There's not a lot of variety, but I think that I did pretty well. I'm wondering how much I weigh now, because I haven't been on a scale for a week, and being on gastric bypass, like, you weigh yourself, like, every other day or every other, like, two days, sometimes every week. Before I left, I weighed 161, so it's, it's going to be weird. <laughs> going back tomorrow and weighing myself and see how much I weigh. I will post some pictures um, and maybe a little bit of video. I didn't vlog a lot during this trip because it was just, I was trying to relax and stuff. But right now I'm having a little bit of orange juice with some vodka, not vodka, tequila. And it's, I'm trying to relax on this last day. I already have everything packed up and ready to go. I'm pretty much ready to get back home because I feel like Christmas is right around the corner. I should be shopping for last minute Christmas presents. And I'm getting ready for his family to come visit too. So I have to get ready for that. December is going to be filled with a lot of family activities and shopping and stuff and hopefully I, I can meet the deadline to get everybody's presents in on time and not overspend because I have a budget to stick to so we're gonna do bingo one last time there's like a grand prize of like five thousand dollars I think I want to make one video of solely just talking about cruising in general because I don't know this this cruise has been great and all that but I mean there's some parts that I'm just not liking right now um, to the point where I'm probably going to be looking for a new cruise line. So I'll talk about that in another video. But I will be vlogging more when I get home to my babies than to reality. So I will vlog more later.